library in the state and ranking 46 nationally in size, the Marriott Library is organized in a logical pattern. The collection in the Marriott Library is decentralized. The materials are organized in large subject divisions on various levels in the building. Each division includes books, serials, reference tools, and in some instances, specialized materials. Thus, the student who wishes to locate information about the sciences or engineering must go to level one of the Marriott Library. On level one, as on all levels, you as a library user must be aware of certain organizational procedures which were designed to facilitate information retrieval. These include a reference desk where assistance in locating materials is available, a specialized reference collection unique to the particular division, a collection of current and bound serial publications, a collection of book materials shelved and arranged by either the Dewey Decimal Classification System or the Library of Congress system, and a telephone system which enables you to contact the General Reference Desk on Level 3 for card catalog assistance. At the Science and Engineering Division on Level 1, the Reference Desk is centrally located. At this desk, you may obtain assistance in using the collection from one of the trained staff members on duty. Until you familiarize yourself with the materials housed in this area, ask the librarian at the desk for help. One general request, which is often made, relates to locating and utilizing various specialized reference tools located adjacent to the reference desk. Items in the reference collection are shelved in the stack area adjacent to the desk. These materials are arranged by call numbers. Along with these materials, various indexes are shelved on tables according to the subject areas. For current information on a particular subject, you should consult the serial publications. These publications include journals, magazines, newspapers, and proceedings. To determine whether or not the Marriott Library subscribes to the serial publication needed, you should consult the public serials list located on all reference desks in the library. Arranged alphabetically by title, this tool will indicate the area in which the serial publication is shelved and which volumes are in the library collection and when the Marriott Library subscription started. So, if you are interested in locating the serial Engineering Journal, the public serials list indicates that the library has this publication, shelves it in the Science and Engineering Division on Level 1, and incorporates volumes 1 through the current issues of this serial into the collection. Current issues are shelved alphabetically by title, and bound volumes are shelved alphabetically by title in a separate section. For information concerning the sciences and engineering, the collection is arranged according to two systems of classification, the Dewey Decimal Call Numbers and the Library of Congress Call Numbers. In order to locate book materials, you will need to use the card catalog on level one. Whether you approach the use of the card catalog with an author, title, or the subject in mind, you will find the call number located in the upper left-hand corner of the card. A Dewey call number always begins with numerals, and the Library of Congress call numbers always begin with capital letters. After you have recorded the call number for the book, return to the Level 1 Reference Desk and check the floor plan on the desk counter. The floor plan indicates the location of the Dewey classification call numbers in the stack and the Library of Congress collection. If the call number begins with numerals, you will proceed to the Dewey stack area. The books are arranged numerically from the smallest number to the largest. If the call number begins with capital letters, you will go to the Library of Congress stack area. The arrangement is in alphabetical order in accordance with the first two letters in the call number. If you wish to borrow the book for use outside the library, you must take the book to the circulation desk on level three or go to the west entrance on level two. At this desk, you will fill out the appropriate card and present your ID. When the circulation system is fully automated, it will not be necessary to fill out a call slip. 
In some cases, you may not need the book for extensive use. So when you finish using the book in the library, return it to the blue shelf areas in the stack. The librarians will reshelve the books. Along with handling the materials in the science and engineering division, the staff on level one will provide assistance if you wish to use the map collection. This unique collection is located directly across the hall from the science and engineering division. This collection consists of a 65,000 map collection featuring U.S. Geological Survey maps, selected army maps, road maps, city plans and county maps, and some historical maps. To gain access to individual maps in this collection, you must use the special card catalog in this area. Because of the unique nature of this collection, the cards in this catalog are not duplicated in the main card catalog on level three. When searching for a specific map, retrieve the call number from the upper left-hand corner of the card and proceed to the appropriate map case. These cases are marked with guide cards corresponding to the call number designations. For assistance in utilizing the materials in the map collection, go to the reference desk in science and engineering. The librarian will be happy to help you locate materials. Many of the procedures discussed in this presentation are also applicable on the other levels in the building.